A tracer bullet of a throw. A casual throw, like playing catch. Two extremely contrasting throws. When and why? The horizontal distance covered by a projectile is called its range. Notice the range as we launch cannonballs at the same speed, but different angles. It appears that the range increases as the angle increases. In that case, the maximum range should be at 90 degrees, right? Clearly <laughs> not. As the launch angle increases beyond 45 degrees, the range starts to decrease. If you're thinking the range is highest at 45 degrees, then you're right. Interestingly, the range is identical for some pairs of angles, 10 and 80, 30 and 60, and so on. Yes, for complementary angles. So, if the range is identical, then what is the difference between these throws? Time of flight. The flatter throw, one with a smaller angle, lands first, as compared to the one with a higher angle, or a more loopy throw, which stays in the air longer. So when a batter is sprinting for quick runs, time is of the essence, and the fielder chooses a flatter throw. And when it's a breezy single, the fielder also goes for an easy breezy throw. Why do you think a looper throw is easier than a flatter one? Comment your views below and stay tuned to Wicket to Wicket.